with KHO and two weather, Justin Cruz. This storm is in complete control of our weather. It's a fairly typical wet season storm with a cold front, and that's what's bringing in all these gusty winds as well as the heavy rain. 74 right now, southerly winds at 16 miles per hour, but those wind gusts have been up to 30 miles per hour. Here's a look at the West Oahu Cam. This is located uh, by Wet and Wild in Kapolei, and the rain hasn't reached this area yet, but it is in Waianae, and it is moving towards uh, the Kapolei Makakilo Eva Plain. It could be any minute that the showers will start to ramp up. So just a heads up on that. We still have a high rain chance and uh, gusty winds at times, but here's how it's going to pan out as we look overnight tonight in through tomorrow. The heaviest rain by 6 a.m. tomorrow morning will start to thin out for Oahu and still remain over Maui County. As the day progresses, it pushes more into the Big Island while we see some clearing for Kauai as well as Oahu, 3 p.m. Tuesday, and then continues to push into the Big Island by 10 p.m. tomorrow night. The good news is that by early Wednesday morning, we're done with this system, only to have a sunny Wednesday and then a Hanaho with that wet weather in a different storm, a secondary storm, moving through Thursday and Friday. This one is not expected to be as potent, as strong, but it will bring some heavy rain to the state. Speaking of, there's two distinct areas of heavy rain that is quite obvious. The one that is over Maui County and the other one that is moving into West Oahu. So both have triggered flood advisories. We have a flood advisory for Oahu through midnight tonight, you can see how the heaviest showers are slowly inching towards town there. And we also have a flood advisory for uh, Molokai through 1130 tonight. Now keep in mind, if the rain continues, and there's a good chance of that, that flood advisory may be extended. We are under a statewide flood watch through at least Tuesday evening. Closer look at Molokai, you can see all that heavy rain just now. The west side of Molokai has cleared. You can see how it's kind of inching towards the Halava through Kaunakakai. And then what's left of this is also headed to Maui itself. Now, West Maui and the West Maui Mountains, Lahaina area, are still seeing showers right now. They're not, they haven't been as intense as Molokai, but again, it's moving your way. Lanai is also seeing heavy showers quickly moving through, and this is gonna be a situation that's pretty much gonna last all night long. No potential issues right now for the Big Island. Big Island, you get your heavy rain by tomorrow morning. Surf for the islands tomorrow, 14 to 18 north, west seven to 10, south at two to four, east shores, at three to five. S uh, still tomorrow, we have about a 70 to 80% chance of rain Tuesday. We get our sunshine back Wednesday, but look at this, Thursday, Friday, another round of wet weather, northerly winds Friday and Saturday. That's gonna drop the temperatures high of only around 72, low in the 60s. It's gonna be at least 50s for the upper elevations. And by the way, the weekend looks good, no heavy rain.